Hello everybody and welcome back to Roki. Um in the last episode we um we met you know, we met Tove and Lars. We found out that their home life is definitely not the best. It sounds like mama's dead and papa is very sad. Tove has to take care of everyone. We read a story, some ravens tried to stalk Lars while he peed, and then we got attacked by a giant monster, so now we're trying to escape. So we need to get the sled. Yes. Our old flashlight. We took it camping back then. Ugh, no batteries. Maybe there's some spares down here somewhere? Oh, there's gotta be. Let's see. Update. This can't be real. A monster? What is it? What does it want with us? Please wake up, Tuve. What if it's real? Have to protect Lars. And Papa, please be okay. Oh yeah, Papa, like, probably died. He got hit by a bunch of wood on fire. Empty. Would have been too easy, I suppose. Okay. Eh. Oh, what did we find? Oh, I found a battery. Is that enough? Do we need more than one battery? Can I click this on? Another light. I wonder if... Okay, maybe that's a bad idea. Oh, get out of the way, get out of the way. Stay there, Lars. This could get hairy. Oh, dear. Like a moth to a flame. Oh, I see what we have to do. Just needs one more battery. All right. I wonder if any of her things are still down here. I think she's talking about her mom. What is all this junk? Nothing useful in here. Oh, are we gonna have to take it from the robot? What'd we find? Thin and sharp. A chisel might be useful. Sorry, kid. I think I need to steal from your robot. I can't get it open with just my nails. That's what the... The chisel is for. Use the chisel on the robot. Nice idea. Not the right tool for this job, though. Okay. It's stuck. Chisel? Chisel. Chisel. Maybe if I wedge this... There we go. What'd we get? Ha! Got it. Huh. It's a small screwdriver. Oh yeah, we are gonna have to break into the robot. Sorry, Lars. It's either this or we die to a scary monster. The ends justify the means. We could take- I mean, we could probably take the robot with it if we wanted. We just can't- He can't stay on. Please work, please work. Sorry, Lars. Hey, Robo was protecting me. That's right, Robo is going to help us get out of here. A battery, and it's the right size. Sorry, Lars. You okay, Lars? Blonk. He'll get over poor Robo in time, I'm sure. Sorry, kid, we needed to. Yes. Perfect. Okay. All right, we need to use it, flash it, right, give us a hand wherever you are. Please? <laughs> oh, no, Lars. Pretty, please? Oh, dear. Talk, monster! Yes, please be as fast as I remember. Out we go. Come on, Lars. Oh, we made it out. Oh my goodness. That's the monster from the art. Kinda looks like his stuffed rabbit. Whoa, 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 what about Papa? He'll, he'll find us later. I'll look after you, I promised. I'll look, and I'll look after Mr. Jotun. Good, don't drop him. We'll go fast down the mountain. Mr. Jotun would like that. Yes, so fast we fly. Then hold on tight, and no matter what you see, don't let go.
Off we go. Oh, that is so scary. It looks like a little rabbit, though. Oh no, I think it saw us. Oh, it's so saw us. Down we go. Let's see how fast we can go. Whee! Hold on, Mr. Jotun. I think we're safe for the moment. Don't look back, Tobey. Can we go even faster? Yes! Let's make sure that thing can't catch up. You and Mr. Jotun hold on tight. Down the mountain we go. Oh, you can see the fire! Oh, I hope nobody goes up to help just because there's a freaking monster up there. It's gonna be okay, Tiny Tomte. Come on. <laughs> Tove, when will we see Papa again? Oh. What can she say? Just as soon as we can. So let's get some help, okay? We can cut through the forest and into town. But, but the forest is scary! Is it scarier than the other thing? Yeah, it's... I mean... <laughs> I think the forest isn't as bad as a giant monster, but... Still, there might be things in here. W there was that, lo that wooden <gasps> thing earlier. We have to keep going. <sighs> Tove, I'm so tired. Can we sit down? It won't be too long. It can't be. Come on. Keep up. Not much longer, surely? Wait one sec. What's the... What's the... I think they're walking in the background. Okay. Uh... We can make it. We're gonna find the town. Maybe, maybe we can find a friendly Oliver to show us the way. Lars! We're not lost. There's no such thing. I think we might be lost. Or maybe there is. I don't know anymore. Oh, there's more ravens. They're watching us, just like the book said. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh no, seems like a dead end. Is that what I think it is? Lars, stay close. Oh no, Lars? No, Lars, come back. Oh no. Did the thing get him? Oh no. Those were here a minute ago. Oh no, oh no, Lars. That kid got it. Mr. Jotun found an Alva. Oh no, he's about to get snatched! Don't run off, Mr. Jotun! I promise not to lose you! Huh? <gasps> no! Lars! Lars, run! <laughs> Tove! Oh no! <laughs> Lars, I'm coming! Oh no! They. It took him! No, 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 no! Lars! I'll come for you! Hold on! That thing took Lars! Oh no! Lars! Lars! Where are you? The freaking birds are still watching us! A footprint! Must be on the right path. We gotta find him. Arr! Oh, it's the thing! You you scared me. Now where do I go? Lars, can you hear me? 
Lars is gone. I thought he was behind me. I think, I think it got him. Whatever that horrible thing is, I have to find him. We're gonna find him. We're gonna find him. That thing, that mo that wooden totem thing kind of looks like the monster. Oh, it's like the statue near our house. But this one's much bigger. Maybe it's because I hit it with the snowball? Oh, but I think it's related to the raven lady who had the child and the other guardians cast her out. Oh no! How did I? Oh, we're in a loop! Focus, what must I have missed? Oh, okay. So we're in some weird loop-de-loop. Go away, birds. Get your butts out of here. Oh, can we go this way? Oh no, it brings us right back. There must be another path. Oh, oh. what's that? Looks like there's something back there. What is it? Marbles! Lars, you little genius! Okay, so he, he's, he's giving us a path. It's a good thing we read him Hansel and Gretel. I assume we have. Another clearing. Where do I go from here? Follow the marbles. But where are the rest? Need another sign. Did he drop Mr. Bunny? Update. Lars's marbles. He left me a clue. I think that thing broke some trees to throw me off the real trail. I'm sure I'm getting closer though. Hold on, Lars. I was gonna say, is the gu is the monster really that that? Oh, it's just some chilly looking mushrooms. I was gonna say, is the monster that tough? But, little rocks. But, or is he that smart? But, I mean, he did manage to track us down very quickly. Here are the marbles. Lars must be this way. Oh, another one. This is new. I must be on his trail. Okay, more marbles. What's... What is hiding under here? Ugh, just plain old pebbles. I can't miss any clues. Better check under the snow. Okay. Under the snow. Ugh, mushrooms. Oh, under the snow right there? Oh, sorry, I didn't see it. I thought it was a rock. Looks like it's hiding something. <gasps> marbles! Lars must have deep pockets. And after we told him not to put marbles in his pockets, I guess it's a good thing he did. Ooh. Oh no! Tuve, help! Lars! Lars, I'm here, I'll find you! He's gotta be here somewhere. Snow pile, getting chilly fingers. Berries. I won't risk a taste. Probably a good idea. Oh, oh. Snow looks like it's hiding something. Mushrooms. Snow pile. Come on, marbles. Pebbles. Eh. These footprints look fresh. Maybe they went this way. Oh. Maybe. Another snow pile. Marvels! Yes! This must be the right path now. Hold on, I've almost got you. What in the world is that? It's gotta be a portal or something, right? Do they? Lars! Lars, where are you? What is that? Lars! <gasps> oh no! Tuve! We gotta follow him! We gotta get Lars back! Lars. No, I'm coming, Lars! Wait! I'm- ah! Whoa, what happened? Ugh. Is it a fairy circle? What happened? Lars. Lars! 
Lars, where are you? Is it a dream? No, things are different. If it was, then where's Lars? And the mushrooms are moving. And if it wasn't... I have to find him. He'll be so scared. Oh god, the mushrooms are moving! <laughs> oh! Wait, where are they going? Look, the, 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 the... Wait. I was too late. Lars is gone and I don't know where. He was so close, but that monster thing grabbed him and pulled him through that whatever it was. I need to find a way to get to him. There's gotta be someone or something that can help me in the forest. I wish Papa were here, but he might not even be... No, I've got to believe he made it out. Stay strong, Lars. I'll find you. Okay, these things, they're the guardians from the story. Uh. It's so pretty, but I can't think about it yet. What's over here? Oh, Whoa. this tree is huge. It must be so old. What are these ravens doing in it? Doing to it? Oh, are they trying to make it so the sun can come to our world? I found an amazing tree. It's so big I could walk inside of it. It was full of ravens pecking at it. Horrible things. I wish I could make them fly away. Why are there so many ravens in the forest? They're related to the the Jotun raven. The one who turned human to have a child, and then the other ones cast her out, right? Whoa, there's a lot of areas in this place. Okay. And... Pry that door open. No! Did it! I'm coming, Lars! Oh, another one of those things. Oh! <gasps> yeah! Tree eyes! Did the other trees have eyes like this? Or did the ravens- Oh, <gasps> That's what the ravens were doing? You see us, human child? Y uh, guess you're r real? We are the tree of many, child. Who are you? Why are you in this place? T Tuve. We s hmm. We see you are lost. No, you have lost. Please, my brother Lars. He went into something, a light, and inside, the portal was opened? A portal? That's it! How do I open it again? You do not. Why not? You are a mortal, child. Only Jotnar, Jotnar can summon the portal. Jotnar... Giants? The guardians of our realm. Where are they? Do they have my brother? Gone for many seasons turnings. We cannot say where. Please, I need to find him. I have nowhere else to go. Our eyes no longer see beyond this place, but perhaps... Yes? If you help the forest, it may help you in return. If you can look beyond your fear. Is there anything I could help you with? Hmm, our mother is across the clearing. Perhaps you could help her. The tree with the carvings and ravens. They keep her from us. They plague the forest. They keep us blind. I'll get them away from her. I'll find a way. Yes, so the... the A tree with eyes? When did everything become so strange? The tree spoke to me, but I didn't see a mouth. Or teeth, thankfully. If it, it wants me to find and help its mother, then it might help me in return. It seems to know things about the forest and whatever's been happening. Perhaps it can help me figure out what's going on. So we need to help get rid of the, the stupid birds. Uh, well, she was the... Hi, guys. Hello. Are you the great mother tree? The ravens. Are those your eyes? I've got to get them away. Can I shoo them away? Yeah, go, 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 go away. What are these? They look like doors, but I can't see a way to open them. Oh, I can't... Okay, I need something... There seems to be a door here, but it won't open. Can I... I need something to get rid of those ones at top. The tree is huge. It must be so old. What are these ravens doing to it? There's gotta be something to get those birds off. Hmm. 
find a way to help the mother tree, so I think we might have to keep going and see if we can find anything to get those ravens off on top. Hang on, bud, I'll be right back. I'll help your mom. Oh, snowbells? Oh, I can't touch them. Oh, is that a village? All the mushrooms. Oh, more of those stupid ravens. Oh, what's that? It's coming. Sniff. Oh, it's a troll. Is that a troll? Oh, poor Hildy. Hello? Are you... Do you need help? A man. You've come to hurt Hildy again. No, no, I want to help. I'm a girl, not a man. Are you a troll? Troll Hild. Yes. Girl, want to help Hild? If I can, what's wrong? Human thorn prick Hild. Hild can't remember when. Hild stood long time. Don't want to turn to stone. Oh, that's terrible. I'll try to help. Met a troll. A troll! She was huge and scary, but quite nice, really. Maybe they aren't as bad as stories say. Lars would be so jealous. Maybe we can visit if her if I get back. Get him back. When I get him back. Alright, how do I help you? Aha. It's a rusty dagger stuck tight. Oh, I can't reach it. Girl pull out thorn. Yes? Then Hildy can find her troll gold. Mmm, troll gold. I'll find a way. We'll help you, Hildy. We just need something long? Something long that can pull out the thing in your in your arm. What's that? Huh? Raven carving. I wonder who left this here. <gasps> there's sure something scary about it though. Seems like there's several of them. That's definitely not eerie at all. Oh, it's locked. Oh, it's locked. I bet I can find some way to open it, though. Oh, there's something over here. There's several things over here. Let's start down here. Oh, is this our house? Hand carved ravens, they're so lifelike. <laughs> this must be where the ones outside were made. Huh? An old mattress, family size. Wonder why they left. Papa, Papa would love this place. Oh, ladder. Let's go down. See if we can find anything to help the troll. Ah. Tin of porridge oats. Found a really old hut, almost snowed under. Looks like it belonged to a woodsman. I wonder if it was THE woodsman, the one from the stories. There's something about this place. Like everything I ever read in those tales could be true. But uh, there's a cat and carvings of raven- a cot and carvings of ravens. But it seems like it was abandoned in a hurry. Did someone or something come for them? Maybe. <gasps> that bear trap looks horribly dangerous. These things are so cruel. As we pick it up, they are cruel, so we're gonna be the cruel one. Ah! Okay, that was a real crow. Wood shavings. Maybe a carpenter used to live out here. Oh, what's that? Huh? There's something in here. Here's your little creature. Do you want to come out? I'm hiding. Go away. Oh, why are you hiding? In case she comes back. Who? Her, stupid human. Hey, rude creature. Sorry, hungry creature. Hmm, maybe if I find you a smack, a, a sna not a smack, we're not gonna attack this thing. Maybe if I find you a snack, you'll tell me about it. A snack, croak, maybe. I have something for you. Take these. That'd be a waste of good oats, but. He said he's hungry! Uh -huh. Whoever 
lived here was making a cot. Oh, it's a baby-sized cot. Okay, so we have something to pull out. Thing. Snacks. A little spinning top. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> nice. What is that? God, what are these things? Maybe I could cut through them? Oh, we need the sword. Let's see. If we go up here, what can we find? Maybe an egg for the hungry guy? Nest. I wonder what kind of birds made them. Nothing in this one. What about in this one? Why build this platform? Did they need the nests for something? Maybe if someone hid treasure in them. Maybe not. Last one. Oh, there's a hairpin in here. Okay, what good does that do us? Oh, can we use that to unlock the... The church? Does Tuve know how to pick locks? I mean kind of wonder how she knows that, if that's the case, but I won't judge because it helps us. Let's see. Hairpins. Yes! So if I can just wiggle this in here and push it a bit here and... Woohoo! Woo I did not expect that to work. Neither did I. <laughs> okay, let's see what we can find here. Yeah, it does look like a church. Nick Bengston, 1750-1812, a king among men. Oh, another tree door! Another one of these trees! Hello, can you open your eyes? I should see if I can find out what's wrong. It's probably these stupid birds! Get out of here! Shoo! Is this a raven trick? Are you a raven? No, there's no more ravens, I promise. Ah, I've closed my eyes tight for so long. Are you a human child? You're not... You've, you've not seen any other children? They sang songs for lost children here long ago. Lost children? Like Lars. Are you like the tree of many? The tree of many is my eldest sibling. The wisest tree, Mother said. I believe humans say know-it-all. Is that correct? Oh, this tree has sass. <laughs> Something like that. What did she say you were? I feel the deepest, she said. Perhaps this is why this place grew around me. She kept us connected through our root ways, but now... <sighs> I can't reach her. The root ways are silent. I'm going to try and fix that. Don't worry, Waytree. We'll help your mom. Found a really old looking church with a little graveyard outside. Looks like it's been abandoned too. Hope it's not got a monster lurking inside, like just about everything else around here. Jo Johannes Mahler, 1832 to 1898, until we meet again. This one is so worn and faded, I can't even read it. I forgot I could run. Malin Hansen, 1868 to 1933. One more star in the sky. Olaf Kallström, 1932 to 1988. Gone but not lost. Mm -hmm. Looks like a family grave for the Marcusons. Mm -hmm. It says they lost their daughter to the watery depths. How horrible. Stig Mahler. 1812 to 1898. Looks like like a good bonfire. You left no trace. Oh. It's all chipped. Anders something. Something belly. How mysterious. Ragnvald Peterson. 1777 to 1856. Valhalla awaits. Oh, cool. You get an achievement for reading all the gravestones. Read every gravestone. Nice! What's in here? Oh, there's more! 
What is this place for? It feels old and sad. Who is this for? Anker Blomquist, 1823 to 1828. Brigida Olsen, 1856 to 1862. Oh, is this the lost children that the tree was talking about? Davin Moller, 1878 to 1883. So many names. And all Lars's age. Has this happened before? <gasps> What's this? The ground looks disturbed here. Something's been buried. Looks like a big stone disc. Update. I found a memorial building in the graveyard. It was carved with lots of names. From the dates, it looked like they were all children. I don't know what happened here, but I'm getting a really bad feeling. There was something sticking out of the ground in here, like a big stone plate. I couldn't pull it out with my bare hands, but maybe I'll come back later to dig it up. Maybe we can use the sword for that. Does this just have names too? More names? Rest in peace, whoever you all are. Hmm. What's this? No, wait, go back in. Turn around. <laughs> it looks like we can mess with this. This is holding something in place. Oh, so if we get- if we find the other one... Oh, okay, but we can't pull that out yet. We need something to pull it out. Let's check the church. I gotta remember that I can run. Oh, this place is so sad. It's been completely abandoned. Oh. What's this? Rope? Oh, from the troll! Ha! Old but sturdy rope. More graves? Or just a memorial? There must have been something important about them. Carl Carlson, 1623. Looks like no one's been here for a long time. Except the ravens! Oleg Peterson, 1326. Oh, why is there only one name? Are they like babies that died? William Olfson, 1263. Oh dang, we're going far back. Carl Bauer, 1236. What's that on the ground? Yes! That's a pretty beetle shell. Might make a nice addition to the journal if I can talk correctly. Nice. What's this? Uh, Looks like there's a room under there. Hmm, I don't think I'm strong enough to crack it open more. Dang it! Someone left a book behind. It's a parish register. Whoa. So many names. Wow, all the people from long ago. Oh, we can go up. Let's scare out those stupid birds. Hope this ladder isn't too rotten. Oh, it's the bell. What a view. Can I look down? <laughs> let's go up a little more. Let's ring that bell. I don't know what it'll do, but let's do it. Oh, there's flowers. What a beautiful flower. Okay, that one in our inventory. Maybe we can... Looks really heavy. This place is falling apart, but somehow it's still up here. Oh, what if we drop it? Would we be able to get to the bottom floor? <sighs> Looks really heavy. Oh, I guess we can't. But we got an orchid. Surely that does something. Is it an orchid? I don't know my flowers. I am here to help. I have help. Have you seen any other children in the forest? No troll children now. Troll sisters all alone. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Me too. I'll find a way to help, I promise. I've got rope. Maybe I can lasso it? Good start, but I need something stronger to grab it. Oh! I've made quite the gadget. Try not to grab her head. Please don't eat me if this doesn't work. Meow. <laughs> oh, it worked. Oh. Got it. Do you feel better now, Trollhild? No more, Thorn. Human girl is mighty. Now can Hild help girl? Maybe. Do you know where I can find the Jotnar? Jotnar? Guardians? No, but sometimes Hilde feel them turn in their slumber. Hilde, sure they are not too far. Rumbles from the west. Trollhild go to cave. Try to remember where Trollgold gone. Nice troll. And maybe there's a guardian not too far away. Troll friend! Okay, we could go... So do we have the sword now? Oh, we do. Can I maybe use... This to lift it up. It didn't do anything. Okay. Hang on. Let's Actually, let's go down here. It's only a tiny stream. Must have been a big river once. What else could this bridge be for? What's in the troll cave? Aw, oh, hi! Oh, sh wow, a troll cave, exactly like Mama's stories. Oh, look at pebbles! We can throw them at the birds! Pebbles. Not as good as marbles, but just as useful. What's this? Hmm, is there something behind this? Can't move it. Somewhere in this forest, I'm gonna find a door that just opens. <laughs> That's a mood. Hey, Hildy. Hey, little Tovey. Is this your cave? Hilda has most beautiful troll cave. Best smelling, nicely soggy. Um, I suppose. Peaceful, when human's not here. Oh, I, I didn't mean to disturb you. You nice human. You won't splash stones in my lovely stream. What's that you're playing? Troll flute. Hilda learning troll song. What's the song about? Song calling for the lost stone troll brothers. Nah. I'm sorry. Can I try it? My brother is lost too. Troll flute only for trolls. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Are you cooking something? Smells, um, interesting. Bones. <laughs> oh! For tea, make Hildy big and strong, but tastes very bad. Human bone tastes best. Oh! <laughs> no more humans for Hild, since meet Mighty Tuve. Humans have feelings. Hildy know this now. That's, um, nice. Thanks. Fish bones only. You want some? Make you as big as Troll Hild? Thanks, but I don't think it'd work on me. How do humans make tea? Dried leaves in little bags. But Mama used fresh leaves and flowers. You gave Hildy Mama... Tea recipe? Make Hildy's bone tea delicious. I don't know. I'm sorry. If I find tea bags, I'll bring them. Kind human. Hildy right to not make you into tea. Thank you. What's that on the wall? Ew, troll snot. Lars would love this. It'll make a nice addition to the journal. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna leave this episode off here. We did a lot of things today, I think we got a lot done, even though we weren't able to finish everything in this area. But we, we helped the troll, we got that achievement for reading all the graves, we found a, a book and some flowers and some oats and some pebbles, which I bet we can use the pebbles in the big tree, but we'll have to do that next episode. So thank you guys for watching, remember to take care of yourselves, and have a good day.